like the party's over. Guess we'd better be going too, right? Wrong. That Phantom isn't getting away with this. I was afraid you'd say that, Fred. We're gonna track him down and find out what's behind his appearance. Okay, let's get out of these costumes and search this house for clues. Shaggy, you and Velma take the upstairs. I can't help it. It like needs oil. He's around the corner. We've got him now. But I don't want him. One thing I hate is a coward. Now get going. Oh, no. We've been following a bowling ball. Yep, it's a bowling ball, all right. <laughs> like Dom did it again. 
And with all that noise, there's no chance of trapping the horseman up here anymore. You go get dumb, and I'll meet you downstairs. Okay. Scooby Dumb, where are you? Scooby Dooby Dumb! Scooby, that's not your cousin. Huh? That's your reflection. <laughs> that's me, all right. Sorry. It's old Pumpkin Puss! Right? He's coming after us! Yeah. Yes. Look, we wrapped old Pumpkin Puss like a salami, Scoob! We did? <laughs> Correction, it's only a dressmaker's dummy. Dressmaker's dummy? Everybody, there he is, old Pumpkinhead. Oh, he got away. Maybe he did this time, but he left us a clue. Look, these wood chips. Clue? Boom, 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 boom. <gasps> that sounded like your aunt's in trouble. Come on. His head came out from the wall. It was ghostly white. It grabbed for my head. Oh, I woke up just in time. Not your head, Aunt Gertrude, your necklace. The curse on that diamond is the cause of everything that's happened here this evening. Did you say curse? Huh? Yes. You should have left the necklace in the vault. Oh, uh, this is my cousin Elwood. Now, how do you do? The headless horseman appeared as soon as you brought that diamond into this house. Oh, dear, Elwood, for a businessman who runs a big company like Apex International. Oh, it's recording you. Yeah. You can go ahead and watch. It's pretty cool. Yeah. Gets it nice and bright. I like that. Yeah. Oh, wow. This thing's cool. A little smudge and a little thing. But <laughs> oh, wow. Perfect. You know how you were saying that one drug, how it, like, leaves traces? Yeah. Well, it doesn't exactly leave the trace, but it kind of... Kind of cool. Weird. Oh, yes, it's got the date on it, too. Doesn't it? No, maybe I don't know. Does it have the date on it somewhere? I thought I saw it. Shoot, man, we have to use this. Okay, you're well, taping. Been, though, we, we no, I think I... Well, that doesn't mean anything. Well, it was on for a I think, I think what it was is I just left it on pause. Oh, yeah, it was on pause. It just shut itself off. Two apps. Okay, i got to start this over. Okay, go. Uh, why don't you only do that twice? You didn't know that? No. What do you want, Josh? Um, uh, how much did you go for? Twenty-five. Twenty-five pounds. You don't have to go. You can do two twenty. And that's what it'd be. I'd go to like 210 or something. Yeah, 210. Let's see. 85, 95. 105. 210. That's everything on the bar. Wait, what'd you, what do you have over there? Uh, 10 and 5 and a 2 and a half. 75, 85, 95. 200, 25, 210. Yeah, that's it. No, it's 25. That's 
Come on, Josh. So we didn't get our praying in this? Or was that it? Yeah. That was it. Okay, 240. What did you do last? Mm -hmm. 240. Yeah, 10. And a 2.5. Come on, Wes. This is it, guys. No, you're putting up 260 today. You've never seen me put this way. So we get to 45. Come on, Wes. Come on, Wes. <laughs> Pretty good, Wes. Wes, 
You're going to have to try 260. Yeah. What do you want, Josh? 230? How easy did you do 235? Or 225? Probably ought to put 10 on. 10 more. I usually always went 10 more unless I was right. Fooling with stuff right at the edge, I always try to go for that. You can do 260. Come on, Josh. Golly, Josh, that looked awfully easy to me. Okay, 2K, 15. 245, as easy as you did that, you gotta try 10 more. You only start going in fives when you just, you know, you just didn't make it or didn't think you made it. 40 more pounds on 300. Yeah, 40 more pounds. Come on, come on, Josh. Come on, man. Oh, you, man. Oh, you, no problem. Oh, yeah. Yeah! Jeez, Josh. That's pretty good. Yeah! Okay, 220, bud. <laughs> Way to go. Man. You going for a laugh? <laughs> you guys are really doing good, man. <laughs> Well, well, you kind of got a test. I hope that it's right, but temper that with the fact that you laid off, and so your potential to increase fast ought to be more than yeah. theirs because yeah. you're you're kind of. That's what I've been noticing is on on our reps, they're not going up very fast. I've been jumping like five pounds of workout. Well, see, you you probably will. You should yeah. jump faster to a certain point. Yeah, it's just my muscles haven't shown anything. I'm gonna hit a plateau. Yeah. But. Now see, Wesley did most of his improvement on a different workout, so it's hard to say yet. I mean, you want to give it a fair try and see. Yeah, but the way you were coming along before, I don't know, you know. Well, that was, that 
that was a good one. I helped about five pounds. Okay. So it's a good thing. Ten pounds. Alright. On this workout in six weeks. There you go. Oh, that's you. Oh, you did. You first 245. Oh, Wesley should be up for 265. Alright. Yeah. Yeah, put a 20 on the outside and that'd be 265. Come on, man. You can do it, man. You got it. Come on, come on.30 to dispatch. Man, what did you just say? 
We're now in Grand Junction, Colorado on Highway 6 and 50 head up to the monument where there was a sighting of some weird creature. We don't know what it is, but we're going to go find out what it is tonight. We're going to try to capture it on film. Speed limit 45. Nope, to see lights. But Josh decides to go 50. That's a, <laughs> oh, Just kidding. That was a driver. We're now going 45 miles an hour. Ah, if I hit 46. My stomach's always hungry around you guys. Oh, really? <laughs> she starts to growl. I must keep the bus above 50 miles an hour. <laughs> we did a spoof on that. It was like speed three. Speed. And we had to keep the bus below five miles an hour. What <laughs> <laughs> kind of maniac would put it on a church van? <laughs> well, we had to think against Cornerstone. It's like, get away. But what about the speed limit? And here we have Laura's hand. <laughs> Grabbing the roof. Um, you can make out that silhouette. That's the back of our car. So we're gonna go we look for this no thing, bar. right? And we don't even have a can of mace or a pocket knife. Oh, I forgot, I forgot my, my laser pointer. I got a machete in the truck. I might we're stop done. it. Okay. Did you get a machete? Here we have Jacob. And hey, I don't have. Over here we have Christy. <laughs> Christy, <laughs> Christy can't yeah. See her. It's like that's one big, huge old blur. Is that thing on? Oh, there's the car. Here we are going into the, what could be the lair of the monster. Probably can't see it very well. Nope. Thought it could have been something, but it's not. There's the moon, and there's Grand Junction. Let's see if we can get a better shot here. Oh yeah, there we go. Oh yeah, downtown Junction. Teeny, huh? Oh, there's the big building, or the jail, one of the two. Where's the moon? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where's the moon? We lost the moon! Oh, it's a little higher than that. Oh, there it is. Forward hoe. Really gonna get us. No, why? We're all like, let's film the monster. Focus, baby. Oh, you know what? That might not have been good. Let me try this again.